It has been more than two weeks since a cyber attack hit the Des Moines Public School District and with no Wi-Fi in some school buildings, it is still just pens and notebooks for students right here at Greenwood Elementary. But not for long. That stack of papers could all be on a computer come Monday. DMPS says by then, Wi-Fi should be working in school buildings. That's going to be um, a big benefit for staff uh, and as well as students. Parents picking up kids Friday afternoon say things are going smoothly. I feel like for, on my side of it, it seems back to normal. Lindsay Sire says communication between the district and parents is back online. I imagine it's a lot more stressful for the actual staff here. Right. Because right. they're still dealing with it. And it. For me, it was like a two-day thing, and it's pretty much over. Heather Brady agrees, but would like to have more information about uh, what exactly happened. I think everything's back to normal for us, but I'm not sure how much they're able to use technology-wise in the classroom. I haven't asked my son every day about that, but I remember when they first went back, they were limited on what they could do. DMPS says it's still working to get all internet systems back online and figure out what exactly happened and what was affected. This is a, you know, an incredibly large and complex system and, and it needs to be done right much more so than it needs to be done fast. The district is still treating it like a ransomware attack, but communications director Phil Rader could not address if a ransom was requested or paid. DMPS is working to get some transportation, business, and finance systems back online, but is looking forward to having Wi-Fi in buildings once again. In Des Moines, James Stratton, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.